Hello, Kamusta. I am Naoko Yamazaki, a former Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency's astronaut. I visited the International Space Station in 2010, and my background picture was taken at that time. I am so delighted to receive many questions from Filipino children, and I'm happy to answer. Hello, astronaut. My name is Marty Shani Aguas. I am 11 years old, and I am in fifth grade. I love science and space. I want to become an astronaut. But if I have my menstruation in space, will the blood go up or float around? How is it like for a woman and girl astronauts to have periods in space? Thank you. I want to become an astronaut, but if I have my menstruation while in space, will the blood go up or float around? And how is it like for women and girls astronauts to have periods in space? Very good question. Yes. You know, women and girl astronauts have menstruation period regularly, even in space. And blood won't float around and blood won't go up. So don't worry, the napkins catches the blood correctly. So there is no spills over, so no problem. And you can also control your mental period by taking pills. It's totally up to you, so your choice. Hi, my name's Kira. I'm five years old. I love to dance. My question is, what is your favorite song to listen to in space? Can you dance while floating? Thank you. Hi, Kira. Uh, what is your favorite song to listen to in space? Well, I brought many songs with me to space and i listen to some japanese traditional songs and some classical songs like baha and i also brought some sounds of nature like winds and rivers and uh, you know waves and so on they relax me very much so i like to listen to many songs and the nature sounds can you dance while floating? Yes, you can dance in space. Of course, you cannot move quickly, but you can still dance while you are floating. Hello. Hello. My name is Mike Steven. I am four years old. I love the planet. The favorite planet is Mars. Why is Mars colored red? Hi, uh, Cleek. Thank you for your question. My favorite planet is Mars. Why is Mars color red? Very good question. Because Mars soil contains uh, lots of iron oxidate. So that is why it seems red in color. And I love to go to Mars as well. and I really, really like the moon because it's so pretty and bright. So what's the prettiest and coolest thing you seen from space? And also, which one do you like more again, being in space or being on Earth? Megan, thank you for your questions. What's the prettiest and the coolest thing you've seen from space. And also, which one do you like more, being in space or being on Earth? Wow, this is a difficult question. I got so impressed with the view from space. And the prettiest and the coolest thing would be, well, I would say the Earth itself. I'd like to tell it, you know, the Earth is like a spaceship and Earth looks like a life. And it's, you know, so dynamic uh, during the daytime, like in this picture, the blue oceans, the white clouds are so dynamic and I was impressed with the nature strength. But at night, uh, lots of city lights 
are so, you know, just beautiful. So I was impressed with the human power as well. And before going to space, space was a special place to, for me to reach out. However, once I got there and saw the Earth from space, I realized it was the Earth which was special and admirable. So I changed my perspectives by 180 degrees. And well, I love to be in space and also I love to be on Earth together with my family and friends. So it's a hard choice. I like to, you know, I'd like to pick up both being in space and being on the Earth. If I can be in space together with my family and friends, maybe that would be the best. <laughs> Again, thank you so much for lots of questions. Salamapo. And I wish each of you all the best in your life and in your career. Space is waiting for you. Salamapo.